a few days since I picked up the vlog. I think the last thing I showed you was me getting coffee. So yeah, we'll just pick up the vlog and finish it today. I'm about to make breakfast. I think I'm just gonna make oatmeal, literally nothing new. But, and then I'm gonna go to the gym. I canceled my Pilates membership and got a gym membership again. So I'm gonna be going to the gym <laughs> and yeah, I don't know. I am honestly over Pilates. I think I just overdid it and now I'm just like wanting to go to the gym and stuff. But anyway, yeah, I'm gonna make breakfast. I like a lot of fruit with it. That way I have like extra that I can eat. So don't mind me. Yeah, that's good. And then we're gonna put a little bit of cinnamon. Beautiful. Okay, and I know this isn't gonna be like super sweet. I this is syrup is just like kind of weird. It's like either too much or too little. So I'm gonna really try to just add like a tiny bit like that, and then that should be good. All right, my boyfriend's parents just came to visit, and they live near a Blue Bottle, so they brought me two things of Blue Bottle. I've tried the New Orleans style. This is the one I usually get, and it's really strong so if you don't really like coffee you probably won't like this one because it has a really strong bold taste but if you do like it then you would love this one i haven't tried this cold brew from them so i'm actually very excited i think i'm gonna just go ahead and do this one camera died last night of course while we were eating and then um i just thought why not continue this vlog into today so i just like wash my face brush my teeth and stuff but now i'm going to journal i really try to journal every morning i haven't been very good about it like the past month so today that's what we're gonna do i use this five minute the five minute journal and it pretty much just prompts you to say like it has like it always has like a quote of the day i don't know if you're able to see it and then it's asking you like um 
to write down what you're grateful for today and then what would make today good um and then like your affirmations and then it kind of has you do like a like the same thing at the end but for the evening so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and do that for today or for right now and then start making some breakfast I don't know if it's like boring for you guys to see me like doing the exact same thing every day. I mean, every morning as far as like, sorry the dogs, but as far as like making breakfast, because I really do mainly have oatmeal in the morning. I went to Whole Foods yesterday and tried to get sourdough for so that way I can make like avocado toast. So usually I alternate between like oatmeal and avocado toast because I'm not a big breakfast person. So there's that. But yeah, I'm gonna journal for a little bit and then and then make breakfast. So that's what I'm gonna do. I also try not to get on my phone in the morning. I used to be really really good about that, but lately I haven't been like the past year or so. I want to say. So I'm getting back into that because I truly do feel so much better whenever I do that. So. going to make something different today because sorry I'm like still my sleeping clothes but because I just got this yogurt from Coco June I usually just get like the little mini ones and I get the strawberry but this time they had um oh they've kind of I always see the bigger jugs but I've never tried the vanilla unsweetened I don't know if I'm gonna like it but I'm gonna add like strawberries and blueberries and then granola and if it's not sweet i'll add honey sorry i feel weird that you guys can't see me but yeah so that's what i'm gonna do well now that you want to look at the yogurt probably um yeah so that's what i'm gonna do fingers crossed it's good and i don't gag because like i don't like plain yogurt hold on i'm scared it's not the worst, but it definitely needs honey. And if the honey doesn't work, it'll be fine with the like fruit and anyways. So yeah, let's do this. I'm probably gonna just do, oh, you know what else I was gonna do? I'm gonna add protein. When I've been eating my oatmeal, it's like obviously love oatmeal. It just doesn't fill me up enough, so. I just feel like I need a little something else. I don't like that much. Like that. And then. And now I'm just going to use this protein. Also, I need to just put my hair in front because. I'm sure you don't want to see that. Um, okay. Just like that. I like that's good. Like I don't need a lot of protein right now. Oops, this is a lot. Hopefully it's not gross. I mean, to be fair, it kind of looks like cake batter or something. Also, I've been trying to teach my dog Banksy new tricks, and I taught him how to shake, so I'm so excited. I just need to be more consistent with trying new things, because he learns it pretty fast. I mean, I think any dog, when you just keep doing it with them, they're going to learn it. So, 
And I've also been giving him like carrots and cucumbers, like just more like vegetables. Because I don't like giving him like, what if I'm eating? I won't give him like my, like a piece of my chicken or burger or whatever. I won't give that to him. But I feel like carrots and stuff like that is like really a nice little treat, especially during the summer. Like I'll, like I have these carrots and I was eating some while I was making vegan dinner or breakfast, I mean. So I just like gave him one. And I think it's like really nice on his teeth. Like it nice and cold, so. I think we can try this. That's a lot better. It's actually really good. I'm not just saying that. Okay. So. Now I'm going to cut some straws. I always like watching people cut things. Like I think it's just very, um, what's the word for it? Therapeutic. But with me, I'm not the best cutter, so I'm sure that's not the case for other people watching me. You probably cringe, but it's okay. We're learning. Also, what the hell, like, strawberries I've been getting, they've been going bad so fast. Like, I don't know what the hell to do. But I actually saw a commercial, so random, saw a commercial about the Ziploc bags. And if you store your fruit in there, like, strawberries specifically is what was advertised, it'll, like, last longer. It's a two times longer. So I'm actually going to try that the next time I get strawberries because... Literally, what the f? Also, I took a cooking class whenever I was like in middle school. That cooking teacher, oh my gosh. Just the meanest woman. Like, you would never imagine that that's your cooking teacher. Like, she was the meanest woman. I would think, like, a cooking instructor is gonna be like so sweet. No. This lady, like, hated her life, hated her job, hated us. So it wasn't fun, but the idea of having doing a cooking class was like super intriguing to everybody. Everybody wanted to be in the cooking class. I got just some of this granola from HEB. Like I just did it in the little dispensers. And it's like a blueberry granola. So I'm just gonna add that on top. Just a little tad more. It's not the prettiest just ignore that but this is it i put so many strawberries don't mind that also but yeah if you want something quick easy and you're not a breakfast person i would definitely recommend this i have tried like obviously the, just yogurt in this combination before but i've never tried it with a protein but i think it's a really good way to have your protein that way if you're a coffee drinker like me, you can have your coffee right away, you know, with just something super quick. I just got a package from Revolve and I've been really needing new shorts and then I saw these shorts from Redone that looked really cute and good for summer. So I ordered these, hopefully, like fingers crossed, they fit me. I hear that their stuff runs kind of I don't know weird so I don't know it looks like it might be a little too big already but yeah they're long have like the rips at the bottom and then yeah so I got these in a size 23 I'm gonna try those on I'm also in my closet right now so don't I don't know you'll probably hear Banksy like getting into stuff and then I also what is this Oh, I also got a belly chain from this really cute brand called Emma Pills. I didn't know that's what it was called until now, but like this is such cute packaging. It's like a little suede 
little pouch for it which is really nice because anytime i get body chains i don't have anywhere to store them where they won't get super tangled so i'll have to try this on for you too but it's just this really beautiful little body chain with flowers on it i don't know if you can tell but it's just like gold with like pink flowers so cute i also got new clips and it comes in a pack of four which is really nice okay i was gonna try on like a full little outfit with them just to give you the gist but they don't fit so we're just gonna stop here <laughs> that was like really hard but yeah they're just like too big around the waist and these are size 23 i don't know maybe they yeah they're just too big like down here it's like so low my crotch is like up here <laughs> um so that's a bummer they're probably true to size if you're tall but i'm like 4 10 so that i guess doesn't really count i just put a little bandeau over this and it kind of stinks because i would totally wear these like this like at the beach like this is the kind of shorts that i would like at a beach versus like putting something on that's like I don't know, super tight. But now we're going to try this on. And I'm like praying it fits, but by the looks of it, it's not. This is literally my struggle. I could do that. No, I could. If it was tighter, it's supposed to be like this. And that would have been super cute. I'm so sad. Short fucking problems, bro. See, that's cute, but I would not be able to wear them or wear it with like a bathing suit because, like, that's so cute. Like, if I were to be at the beach and have a bikini, you can't tell me that wouldn't be so cute. But I can. I there's no way I can keep these and justify these being humongous on me there's literally no way but i wish i also have these new shoes that i bought so i'm gonna actually pick you up and i'm sure you've seen them places i just thought they were the cutest things in the entire world so i had to get them but they're the adidas the gadita is l the gadita Am I broken? The Adidas Gazelle and this pink. They're so cute. I would say I have like a little bit of room, but if you wear thick socks, it would be fine. So, that's what I'll do, but I just think they're so cute, especially for summer. So, I'm excited to wear them. I like want to do something so I can get dressed up and wear these. But, anyways, yeah, that's a little haul. I'm super sad about this i feel like this happens to me a lot with revolve though like i feel like their stuff runs pretty big so i can't say i'm surprised but i always am hopeful <laughs> but yeah that's my little haul so i'm probably gonna go make some watch and then take banksy for a little walk Okay, so it's now later on in the day I've honestly just been sitting on my computer for a really long time because I'm trying to look for bedroom furniture I need to get a bed I need to get nightstands a lot of stuff so I've been trying to look and get like a list of stuff like that but now I'm about to take Banksy on a walk I'm just wearing these like aloe bike shorts 
and then this like lululemon sports bra and then just like a sweater on top from aritzia I'm gonna take this one on a walk right oh look what i taught him shake good boy big c let's go for a walk come on let's go come on good boy okay i'm in the kitchen now what's new i'm just gonna show you what i'm doing for me I'm gonna do some carrots, some spinach, some cucumber for the salad. I don't have any lettuce, so this is just gonna be like a spinach salad, really. And then I have some leftover ground beef. Might as well use these leftovers that we have. And then I have this dressing. It's like a spicy chipotle ranch that I got from Salada, and I had some extra, so I'm gonna use that. For the dressing and then also i feel like i was gonna add something else oh i'm gonna do some broccoli so i should probably cut up the broccoli before i start doing everything else can i wait for this broccoli to be done i don't know actually 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 wait for that to boil i also need to invest in some more knives Cause I'm gonna get Banksy a piece. He loves cucumber. He recently just discovered it, so I'm just gonna give him like this. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> it's gonna be a whole lot of cucumber, but whatever. It's gonna be a plain freaking salad. Okay, so now we're gonna put the broccolini in here. I know it wasn't gonna look amazing when I showed you, but warmed up the beef, the ground beef, did a little spinach salad with cucumbers and carrots with like a spicy chipotle ranch dressing. So I'm just gonna have this. I could eat stuff like this. All the time. A little scoop of beef. Anyways, I'm sure you guys don't want to see me eat, so. I'm probably ending off the vlog right here. Yeah.